say person who had been receiving treatment for last 20 years in a perfect manner suddenly lost his job and is unable to continue his treatment his fate versus second group of patients who had been neglecting their you know disease process for initial 10 to 20 years then got interested say for example for receiving proper treatment the second person's fate is much more worse. The reason is very simple that long-standing legacy is not there in the second group. Now again for selection of these antihyperglycemic agent so many factors are considered like avoidance of weight gain, avoidance of hypoglycemia, I mean maintaining your time in range, better adherence to time in range say for example 17 hours a day I mean 70 to 180 CBG profile and avoiding I mean your white diurnal glycemic variability because it has been already established that higher the adherence to time in range better is the cardiovascular outcome better is the microvascular outcome and lower there is you know diurnal variability again there is better cardiovascular outcome and better microvascular outcome. Depending on this scenario, you know the anti-hyperglycemic molecules are selected and the patients they are kept on regular follow-up treatment program.